New at noon, a history-making change. An Orlando road named after a Confederate general will now have a new street sign. News 6's Ezzy Castro explains how the community came together to push for the change. You can already see the new street sign out here that says Roberto Clemente Road. And this change was a huge community effort in order to spread a message about unity. And City of Orlando leaders, along with community activists with organization Alianza for Progress, gathered to change the street signs on what was called Stonewall Jackson Road to Roberto Clemente Road. And Orlando City Council gave the green light last month for the name change. Last September, Orange County Public Schools changed the name of Stonewall Jackson Middle School to Roberto Clemente Middle in honor of the late baseball player and humanitarian. And it was residents and community activists that pushed for these changes. Clemente's son, Luis Roberto Clemente, spoke about his father and the legacy he left behind. What General Stonewall Jackson stood for and what is being replaced today with my father's legacy and name. It's really significant, really significant for this neighborhood, for this county, city. Roberto Clemente will always represent the hope, will always represent the fight and overcoming the struggles to make sure at least people are treated equally. In March, local artist Neysa Milan painted a mural of Roberto Clemente at the middle school. She was actually honored by the city of Orlando during today's celebration. And Clemente's son, who lives in Pittsburgh, says he is planning a big celebration in September to celebrate his father's World Series MVP win that happened 50 years ago. In Orlando, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.